August the 27th, 2020. As you're looking at uh, Hurricane Laura, Cat 2 hurricane now as it's ashore headed up through uh, east or west central Louisiana at this point, just under I-10. But over in Mississippi, we have a tornado warning that's coming in just uh, up uh, 55, guys, in the Macomb area. And uh, it will be part of the heating process of the day for these to continue. We saw it with the Florida Panhandle with Marco. Now, um, as we're in the north right quadrant, where I'm at along Highway 49 going down between Jackson and Hattiesburg, guys, we're right on the edge of it. We're starting to see some of the wind, and if you have to be on the road, you'll definitely notice that wind. But we got a tornado warning. Um, this storm came ashore at, 10, at 150 miles an hour. That's what they're saying now. So I was off by six miles. I said it would make a Cat 5. I was wrong there, but I would rather err in that direction because 150 mile an hour winds, guys, is much different than 130 mile an hour beginning of a Cat 4. So when you, it's worth uh, being just a little bit wrong because if someone decided at the last minute to get out of there, then it was worth it. So uh, there was a lot of damage in Lake Charles and uh, started to see different bits of information coming out. Glass blown out of some uh, uh, very tall buildings in that area. And it was where the strongest storm surge came in. There's pictures of um, m many, many light poles and electrical poles down, guys, then across the roads. Uh, it's going to take some time to get that power back up. We knew it with a storm like this. But quickly, I want to look at the National Weather Service for you guys in Macomb. And this is going to be moving across our state and up through the Jackson area, guys, throughout the day as the storm moves north. As you can see, i got all kind of wind warnings, uh, flash flood warnings, thunderstorm warnings, uh, high wind surge warnings right here but right here in this yellow area now that covers the western section of our state and our county and uh that yellow is a tornado watch for the day now this red area in south it, they're saying southeastern louisiana but it's really across the state line at this point and it's south of macomb mississippi let's take a look at that warning it says a tornado warning remains in effect until 10.45, which is 15 minutes now from now, at 10.30 a.m. Central Time. It's, it's for Pike County. It said at 10.13 a.m. CDT, a severe thunderstorm capable of producing a tornado was located over Osaka, or 14 miles south of Macomb, moving north at 40 miles per hour. Radar indicated rotation. Flying debris will be dangerous to those caught without shelter. Mobile homes will be damaged or destroy damage to roofs windows and vehicles will occur tree damage is likely the dangerous storm will be over magnolia around 10:30, which is now macomb around 10:35, summit around 10:40. so i'm going to load the video up and uh guys it, it's going to take a minute because everything's moving slow with this weather but this is going to be a pattern throughout the day so keep your eyes on it keep your weather radio on it's a heads up be safe